having a family has changed everything about my life, especially my business. Um, before having children, I, I had liked to think that I was focused and that I had a goal in mind, but it wasn't until I had my first daughter that I really kicked it into overdrive and started figuring out my business and how to make money and how to do better work. So yeah, I think that family and children especially are a lot of the driving force in my life and in my business. I enjoy remodeling for the daily challenges that it presents. I'm always on my toes problem solving. Every single day I get up with a list of responsibilities to do and I show up on the job and it generally changes quickly and I have to think and adapt and make things work. The job we're gonna to head to today is an addition that we added off the back of a house, a kitchen remodel and a dining room remodel. We'll be focusing on the upper cabinets above the range. What interests me most and why I enjoy the kitchens and bathrooms, it's not a long drawn out process. And also I like to have a hand on most of what I'm doing and control over my project. So on these smaller type of projects, I can self perform a lot more work. So that's why it's enticing to me. And I also think it's where people wanna spend their money and they, where they wanna see pretty things um, and where they wanna do cool things and kind of stretch their budget. The job we're working on today, I'll have Steve, my only full-time employee. He graduated from college and decided that he wanted to go into the trades. It's hard work and it's a lot of hours and it's not easy and it's a lot of headache. And Steve has stepped up to the plate since day one. Uh, he works like a dog, he shows up, he's on time, he stays late. And having somebody like that on my team next to me every day actually makes my entire life better. It makes my home life better, it makes my work life better. I think the hallmarks of any successful kitchen install would be your finishes. Uh, the way that everything somewhat pulls together and has a cohesive look to it. Tight joinery, scribes to the wall, the little things that most contractors say good enough on my installs, I kind of want to showcase those elements. I improve my craft daily. There's never a job that I've ever done that I've walked away from and said to myself, I'm 100% satisfied with that. I find flaws and deficiencies in everything that I do. So I think a lot of what differentiates my work from other people is that when I stand back and look at a project, I don't see the amazing factor to it. I see all of the deficiencies. I see the issues that I ran into. I see what I kind of had to adapt to make work. So I think that for me, it's never settling, never being complacent with what I'm doing and never accepting my last job as being good enough. You know, I always want it to be better. I build for my daughters and to prove to them and show them that it doesn't matter what path you take in life, you can be successful if you work really hard and if you have your heart in it.